very good morning students today i tarun sir is going to describe the summary of a very important poem that is a tiger in the zoo written by lesley norris it is included in the curriculum of grade 10 cbsc what is the title all about the title is appropriate and meaningful because in this poet the poet is talking about a tiger that has been caged in the zoo the theme of such poems are number 1 endangered species are tigers really getting extinct it's a big question second theme are zoos zoos only a place of pleasure for human beings we have trapped and we have caged these animals only for our pleasure this is also a big question mark and you can get a question that what is the theme of this poem you will have to mention these two themes let's understand the summary a tiger that is moving around in its cage such a fearless tiger that is moving around in its cage is seen helpless because it cannot create any kind of terror inside the cage the beautiful body of the tiger has been described as vivid stripes along with soft paws but what does the tiger do inside the cage only moves around at the night looks at the stars hears the sound of patrolling vehicles of police so these all terms that are being used for the tiger these are used only for personification personification is a figure of speech in which a non living thing or an animal starts behaving like a human being so this is what the poet has said in case if the tiger would have been outside the cage what it would have been doing so let's understand that what is the real and natural habitat of a tiger obviously it's a forest the tiger might be creating terror in the minds and hearts of villagers it might be again behind the trees hiding itself in order to catch for its prey that is deer so this is what is being described that now the tiger that is behind the cage is helpless on the other hand we all we already know that the tiger is a fearless wild animal but in the cage it is helpless so this is a message from the poet that in order to fulfill their pleasure pleasurable activities zoos are being zoos are being the most important eye catcher destination for human beings we visit these zoos in bulk we go there to enjoy rather we ignore one thing that is respect towards animal how can we cage a tiger where its natural habitat is the forest giving other examples how can we trap a crocodile crocodile needs deep water so the poem is all about a tiger in the zoo that is seen helpless and a fearless tiger in case if it is outside the cage that what all activities it would be doing the figure of speech that is used in this poem there are many figures of speech number 1 personification metaphor simile oxymoron so these are the figure of speech used in this poem any doubts you can call me at 9839305466 or keep watching my videos i would be further explaining about the other question and answers and other explanation thank you so much